It should also be noted that in the last few days, John Huntsman has suddenly started running a much better campaign, certainly a much more aggressive campaign. Last week on this show, we reported on the existence of this crazy, racist, cockamamie ad attacking John Huntsman. Uh, that was not from any other candidate's campaign, uh, but it looked like it was from supporters of Ron Paul. The ad called Mr. Huntsman the Manchurian candidate. It criticized him for knowing how to speak Chinese. It cast really gross aspersions on him for adopting daughters from China and India, essentially calling him foreign or anti-American for doing that. It was gross. It was, it was in fact, so gross, it, it almost almost seemed funny before it's just not funny and it's gross again. It's also important to note uh, that that campaign, uh, that, that ad, excuse me, was not from the Ron Paul campaign. Um, it is out there though and it did appear to be from a Ron Paul supporter. And now not only John Huntsman himself, but the Huntsman campaign and even Mr. Huntsman's wife have been everywhere criticizing that ad. Governor Huntsman's wife calling it, quote, absolutely disgusting and using the attack as an opportunity to tell their family story, including uh, the adoption of those daughters. When I saw John Huntsman speak on Friday when I was up in New Hampshire, he ended his discussion with a long personal discussion of how much that ad bothered him and how much he loved his daughters and how he and his wife came to adopt them. It was very, very affecting. It was the most emotional and connecting thing that he did in that whole campaign appearance. Here's the thing, though. And this is kind of amazing. The Ron Paul campaign now says that it commissioned a study, an audit, I guess, um, of where this anti-John Huntsman ad came from and who has been circulating it. The Ron Paul campaign says it has looked into where this campaign ad came from and who is circulating it, and they think it's John Huntsman. Seriously. Here's from the, the quote from the story about this. After researching the available evidence, we believe it is likely that the video came from a source within or closely tied to the Huntsman campaign. The study they commissioned says the Huntsman campaign website, john2012.com, linked to the video a day before it was picked up on Facebook, on Gawker, on Red State, and elsewhere. So. Is the John Huntsman campaign so nails that they would use this disgusting ad against their own candidate, both for the attention and to give him the moral high ground? Give him a very, very moral high ground way to talk about his own family background? Could they have even created this horrible ad themselves? That is what the Ron Paul campaign appears to be suggesting. The Huntsman campaign absolutely denies that. But in the history of campaigns, Weirder things have happened. Things this outrageous do happen in campaigns. They happen when campaigns are brutally, aggressively, tactically ruthless. 